Sidewalk chalk. All the kids are doing it. But have we ever stopped to think, should all the kids be doing it? Because sometimes the things we do avoid that critical lens of self-reflection. And who pays the price? We, we all, all do. do. And that's because in today's America, in today's America sidewalk, sidewalk chalk, chalk poses a multifaceted threat matrix that only the combined efforts of our most elite, austere religious scholars, PE teachers, frontline medical aestheticians, academic and political leaders, and key grips can get a handle on. Think you can handle it? Think, Think again. again. December 13th, 1182, Bavaria. By the time he'd reached the age of only 12, young Wolfram von Eschenbach was the star hopscotch player on his block. But this morning, he reached for the sidewalk chalk to create a new course, a course of his own design, which resulted in a badly sprained ankle. August 14th, 1998, Mount Vernon, Iowa. Hungry after long games of ultimate frisbee and hacky sack with friends his mother referred to as bad influences, influences. Maddox Cooper realized he was out of microwavable pizza rolls. It don't matter. He thought. I have this monster energy drink and these three pieces of sidewalk chuck. Bad decision. November 17th, 2020. As if the year hadn't given us enough to be concerned about, listen to the sad story of one Cindy Jenkins of Denton, Ohio. Her mother, Meredith, recalls, Cindy got some neon-scented sidewalk chalk at her drive-by birthday party. She got right to work drawing flowers up and down our block. About an hour in, I just heard this buzzing. I looked out the front window, and she was flailing inside this swarm of insects. The combination of colors and natural scents fooled a swarm of murder hornets, which attempted to pollinate the garden of chalk. We're still watching the hornets today. The murder hornets have taken residence in a once quiet Midwest neighborhood, forcing nearby residents to take cover in their homes, unsure when they would be able to go outside again. Any other week of forced lockdown would result in economic strain, food insecurity, and feelings of isolation. Since the pandemic has already caused the aforementioned issues, the murder hornets were simply an annoyance. We need stricter guidelines. We need stricter guidelines. We need guidance stricter for guidelines for sidewalk chalk. If we cannot halt production, then in the names of Cooper, von Eschenbach, von Eschenbach and Jenkins, we Jenkins. demand messaging prohibiting the use of sidewalk chalk for ingestion and for the depiction of hopscotch and flora. Sidewalk, sidewalk chalk. chalk. Don't start, or the next chalk outline you see might be your own.